a really good way to think about it is that MRI gives us a level of information that's equivalent to Google Maps, so the streets and how this the grid looks like. Whereas our technology allows these MRIs to just look, zoom in and look much further inside, again, into the cellular level, into the functional level, and that it can be an equivalent to Google Streets. You can actually watch these molecules transform over time in vivo, in animals or in humans. And um, the way these molecules metabolize can actually indicate cancer. These are all naturally occurring substances in the body, and they're also injected at um, normal physiological conditions. So it's completely harmless. And that's also the great advantage of MRI is that it's completely harmless. Um, so you can do an MRI as many times as you want, and you'll never incur um, damage over time. It's not like these radioactive techniques where you can only do it maybe once per year or twice per year or something like that. 